Alright, follow the instructions. Probably says wash and dry everything, so I'm just gonna skip to the back. Wash and dry. There you go. Hey, bro. How are you doing, buddy? So, on to the next stuff. He wants me to do something at the bottom of the other thing. So, I guess I'll cut these pieces. Cut the green tops into three quarter inches. Oh, well, that's easy. Or wait a minute, that's not all of it. These little things. Okay, one more time. Okay. So with me, you'll notice that uh, I like to use a steak knife for everything. I mean, why not? It works. It's sharp. Not too sharp where it'll destroy stuff. You know, who, who needs... I don't know. I don't really need to destroy my fingers on accident. They're too valuable to me. It's not worth the risk. A steak knife, you can chop your finger and it'll just bleed a little. If you use one of these chef ones to chop your finger, it'll come off. I mean, I'm not skinning a deer here. I don't know how you guys feel about that. Chop these up real quick. Roughly chopped peanuts. Okay. Rough chop. I figure I'll use the really strong knife to roughly chop peanuts. See, once you get one of these in your hand, you just start feeling like cutting everything. So. What's going on over here? Occasionally, okay. So I'm just kind of browning it. Pinch of salt, the rice, two cups of water, the boiling. Check it out. Here's 
what it's supposed to look like. And here's Roller's version. First, I'm going to half of that. Pretty good for that. Yeah, so that's me. What do you think? Some rice down there, got this of that. And then over here we got that one. Maybe a little better looking. There you go, how about that guys? Does that look like this? Oh, take it easy. Hey guys, usually I would make a cooking video, but it's already 8.30. Look guys, I'm making homemade strawberry jam. So yeah, come back and see us. Bye.